All right. Hi, everybody. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Welcome to Messy Play Kits Painting Projects. That's a thing. Um, I've got another really, really fun project for you guys today. Um, and today I'm going to have Mama Bev just do it. She has no idea what she signed up for. Um, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> so I'm just going to talk her through it and we'll see how it goes. So for today's project, you need some sort of a tray. It has to have lips or edges like this. A cookie sheet would work perfectly also. We've got some paper. We've got paint. I always use Discount School Supplies Colorations brand of the washable tempera paint. Um, it's actually really, really washable. That's why I use this. Um, so, and I usually, I like to work in primary colors. You get really good color mixing that way. So we'll set that off to the side. Um, I've got paintbrushes here. You don't really need them though. We're just going to end up using our fingers. And then the key for this one is big, giant rubber bands, like really, really big ones. I bought these off of Amazon a while ago and I got like a three bajillion pack for basically no money. So like these things... <laughs> But I know it's a lot. <laughs> so um, they're really, really fun. If you only have smaller ones at home, just scale down your tray and, you know, make it work. Cut them and tie them together, whatever. So, all right, mom. So her paper's on the tray. Go ahead and take the rubber band. And if I hold the tray up for you, put the rubber band around the tray, like around the whole thing, trapping the paper in there. Yep. Grab more rubber bands. You can do them the long way. You can do them in straight lines. You can kind of yeah, angle them like that. Um, also, side note for this project, you guys, it gets a little bit messy. So I <laughs> really recommend um, wearing aprons or smocks um, or just an old shirt or something like that and doing this project in a place where Oops. maybe you have a bit of a splatter zone. So like the kitchen floor or outside or something like that. But certainly don't set this up in the living room. No, living room. I mean, if you want to, you could. <laughs> All right. How many? That yeah. looks pretty good, Mom. Nope. Just kidding. One more. One Always more one over more. Here. One more over here. You have to have it balanced, you guys. So she set up this really cool design here. The other thing is that actually just flicking them like that. So if you kind of hold it down with one hand and flick the rubber bands, it sounds really cool. And now here comes the fun part, Mom. You're going to either use the paintbrushes or I personally just use my fingers. And we're going to scoop up the paint and we're going to paint the rubber bands with the paint. Paint the rubber bands. Yep. Hmm. I'm going to start with the brush. All right. And Can I help you? Yes. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. All right. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get underneath a little ah. bit. You can get the top also. The top is probably going to be messier on you. Oops. I, got, I got some of the page. Oh, That's well. okay. I think the rubber band will fix that also. So, and we're uh, just kind of going abstract. Yep. Oops, I also got the page. We do also have a, a wet paper towel right here if we need to wipe our fingers off. See, she gave up on the brushes and I was did. going for her Already. fingers. Already. Already. Already gave up. Yep. So, she's doing different sections of the rubber band, all different colors. Let's see. I really... Blue's my favorite color, but I'm going to have to get a little bit of yellow on there too, I suppose. Here we go. Ooh, I'm dripping a lot. That's Okay. Just adds a little bit of texture to the paint, right? I think the we need more red. More red, she says. All right, Mom, are you ready? I don't know. <laughs> I have some of that. Would you like it? Yes. <laughs> okay. No, get your own. Just kidding. Here we go. All right, so I'm going to hold the tray down for her, and she's just going to fling those rubber bands. Oh! oh. <laughs> yep. Also, close your eyes and your mouth when you're doing this. Oh, man. She's, like, not even flinging it very hard, you guys. Hey, you ready? Maybe, ooh, maybe we uh, overpainted this one. <laughs> and this is why I recommend doing this project outside. Okay, can we show you guys what it looks like? Because look at it right now. Isn't that so cool? And now look at us. <laughs> what does my face look like? You don't have anything. I didn't I don't fling it hard enough. <laughs> Would you like to? I wiped off a little bit. I could feel on my ah. chin. All right. So let's go ahead and we're going to start taking off the rubber bands to see the actual paper on the inside. And this alone can be kind of a messy process because those rubber I bands are covered. Yeah. And you need to do the rubber bands that are on the top that yep. you put on last. That's awesome. Very, very cool, mom. 
and you can see the spots that we drip the paint on there like you can see some of them but they don't look bad by any means they kind of blend in a little bit so i know i think she got a little bit of red up there and i was dripping yellow everywhere but look at how cool that is nice yeah way to go mom <laughs> all right have fun you guys Bye. and remember do this project outside <laughs> good idea Bye-bye.